Hi, my name is Alex Clark, brand strategist for Proto Industrial Tools, and I'm here today with Aaron, our very own East Coast Training Manager. Today, Aaron is going to help us walk through our Proto Smart Torque Wrench. This is a Bluetooth-enabled electronic torque wrench that allows you to set the wrench via mobile application. You can then tighten and record your work. Yeah, thanks Alex. We're really excited about this wrench uh, and, the, and the addition to our torque lineup. Given our strong heritage in this space, uh, Proto has a great reputation with micrometer wrenches already, so we're really excited to take this and add it to that lineup and take it to the next level with the new technology. Awesome, I, I really can't wait to hear more. Um, and Aaron, I know in, in your experience with our customers, just curious, who is our, our true target audience with this, this wrench? Sure, yeah. So primarily we're gonna be targeting users in the manufacturing and assembly space, but we also want to look at MRO and then obviously anywhere in aviation or aerospace. Uh, anywhere really where speed, accuracy, and accountability is imperative to the job. That definitely makes sense. And Aaron, I know we had uh, mentioned this is a Bluetooth electronic torque wrench. So with that said, will we need a mobile device to, to be able to use the wrench? Yeah, that's a great point. You do need a mobile device to set this torque wrench with the application first. Uh, so one of the first qualifying questions you're going to want to ask your customer is if he or she can use a mobile device on their location. Awesome, that's great advice. And Aaron, I know uh, some of our customers can have a, a device but not bring it to the specific uh, job site. So what type of advice do you have for those customers? Sure, yeah. For our customers that are not allowed to have a device on site, we've actually designed this wrench to function with limited control. So you can set the torque values and the parameters on the device and then step away from your device to get the job done out on the floor. And Aaron, I know uh, there's specific end users that cannot have a, a mobile device. Can you dive into that a little bit? Sure. There's really there's customers across all verticals that could have potential restrictions when it comes to uh, using a device on site. Typically, it's a safety or security issue, so it's best to really check with them first and make sure that it's okay. So really, Alex, at the end of the day, uh, this new Proto Smart Torque Wrench is going to give our customers the highest accuracy uh, and speed within our range, but it also allows them to record and report every click of the wrench that they make. Awesome. To get started, you're going to want to fully charge your smart torque wrench. The dock securely holds the wrench in place and can be mounted on the wall or a flat surface. Battery life on this product is about 10 hours or 500 clicks, or an average working day. Once the wrench is charged, you should download the app to your mobile device. The app can be downloaded on Android or iOS mobile devices. Search Proto and select the Proto Smart Torque app. To pair your mobile device to the app, begin by powering up the wrench. You will notice a flashing blue light which indicates that the wrench is now ready to connect. Open the Smart Torque Wrench app and select Add a Product. The main screen will indicate whether or not your wrench has successfully synced. When connected, you will receive haptic and audible feedback. Follow the instructions in the app to complete the pairing. You may connect multiple torque wrenches to the same app and scroll between these paired wrenches to manage or connect them. Once connected, you are ready to work. Depending on the job, you'll choose between torque sequence and quick torque. Quick torque would most commonly be selected when tightening one fastener at a time. This is similar to the functionality of a standard electronic or micrometer torque wrench. For example, fastening one bolt to 50 foot-pounds. A single pass torque sequence allows you to tighten several fasteners to their individually specified torque values in a single step or pass. A multiple pass torque sequence allows you to tighten several fasteners to their recommended torque value when they are required to be torqued in cumulative steps. An example would be tightening fasteners on a pipe flange that are required to be set in two steps, 50% in the first pass and their final specified torque in the second pass. To select a tightening option, first tap on the menu icon, then select from the menu. In this example, let's select Quick Torque. Quick Torque allows you to set a value on the wrench, enter the desired torque value, choose the units, and add an angle if required by specification. For left hand threads, you can reverse the bolt direction. Once configured, you can save this to favorites if required. Press start to send the job to the wrench. The wrench will vibrate to confirm the setting and the screen updates. Target torque is shown at the bottom of the screen and bolt direction is shown by an arrow. 
At this point, you no longer need to be in the vicinity of the mobile device and can work in offline mode. You can now tighten the bolt. As you tighten, your progress versus target can be monitored in several ways. The LED lights on the wrench and digital screen will indicate progression. Tactile haptic vibration from the handle warns of your approaching target before a positive click alerts you the target has been met. During tightening, you can also see real-time progression on the app. If you pause before reaching your target, the peak value is then displayed. Once completed, the actual value is shown on the screen and recorded to your history. During this phase, the wrench can work offline. The set value can be repeated indefinitely. History will be saved in the wrench memory and will sync when next connected to your device. If you have more than one fastener to tighten at more than one value, then a torque sequence can be programmed to make workflow faster and simpler. To tighten multiple fasteners to their individual specifications in one step, click on Single Pass. In this mode, each bolt is tightened to 100% of its specified torque. You can have up to 50 steps, and each value can be the same or it can be different. To tighten multiple fasteners to their individual specifications in a series of steps, click on Multipass. If an angle is specified, this can be applied using the optional angle function. Once a sequence is complete, press the power button to restart the sequence without requiring the use of your app. After each tightening, the values are automatically saved to the wrench. When connected, this data then syncs to the app and is stored on the connected device. From the history page, you can view each torque event and see actual versus target and generate a report that is exported and ready for sharing. To create a torque report, begin by tapping on the menu icon, and then select torque history in the drop-down menu. You can filter by date, or by single or multi-pass. Select the job you wish to export, then select Create Report. You can categorize your report as needed, and then click Done. This will then prompt you to email out your report. From the wrench page, clicking on the information icon gives you more info on the current calibration status, the serial number, as well as additional information on the wrench and the ability to perform firmware updates. For more comprehensive questions, please contact your regional manager or the training team.